We wanted to take a couple of minutes of your time to introduce you to our client portal. The portal is one of the ways that you and your staff can get support, manage your requests, view invoices, and more. Now keep in mind, some of these features are based on permissions and may not be available to everybody. Your role in the company will determine what you have access to. If you want to give someone in your organization elevated permissions, just reach out to your account manager. Along the top, you will see some or all of the following tabs. Tickets, projects, recommendations, knowledge base, configurations, reports, and account. Under the tickets tab, you could submit a ticket to our support team. If there's an emergency and you need support quickly, you can flag the ticket as an emergency by clicking the emergency checkbox. This will escalate the ticket above your normal service level agreement. You can also see updates on your recent tickets. This tab serves as a record of communication between you and our support team, allowing you to revisit any tickets that you have submitted in the past. While tickets are for small support tasks, larger scale endeavors with multiple steps are often created as a project under the Project tab. You'll be able to view a project's timeline and communicate with the team throughout the project. The Recommendations tab is where you can find a record of any proposed recommendations that we've created for you and their quotes suggested for your IT strategy and budget. Using this tab, you may review our suggestions as well as accept or reject them. The Knowledge Base is where you can search for documented issues and IT-related questions. Who knows? An answer to your question may already be there. By entering a few key words, you can pull up associated private and public Knowledge Base articles. The Configuration tab is where we store documentation for the many components that make up your IT infrastructure. Whether you need to find your login credentials for your router, review the model number of a PC we help you maintain, pull up software licenses, or even the name of a printer, you can find it in the Configurations tab. The Reports tab can be used to view agreement and service reports. You'll be able to see what work we are doing under your agreements, how much time is left on blocks of time, and other account information. Finally, we reach the Account tab. This tab contains your invoices, as well as information on your agreement and users. Under Invoices, you can review the transactions that you have made in the past as well as check your outstanding balance. For agreements under the account dropdown, you can view the various service agreements your organization has in place with us. Clicking on the agreement will give you more information. You can also manage the users in your organization who can create and view tickets and invoices. If needed, you can also disable a user. Now keep in mind, this doesn't lock them out of your network or revoke any other access other than our portal. So if you want to remove a user from your organization completely, be sure to let us know by creating a support ticket. The Client Portal is your one-stop support hub for all of your IT support. Remember, we're here to help you with all of your technology needs. So if you have any questions or something doesn't seem right, don't hesitate to put in a ticket.